We shall see. It's the Fathead Bourbon at Oaks. Mike Battaglia has the call. For the lead from the outside, there goes Martha's Moon, Silcita, through from the inside, Marathon Lady and Street of Gold. But into the first turn, Martha's Moon has the lead. Now by a length, Silcita second, Awesome Mama on the outside, third ahead. Marathon Lady now runs fourth, Street of Gold fifth ahead. The Fascinator is sixth, Pure Fun gains from seven. Then from between horses, that's corporate culture with broken vow, Miss Squeal, gap of two and a half. Then we get Always Kitten and Anna Hawk Trails 24 flat. For the opening quarter, the leader is Martha's Moon. Has it by a length, Silcita second ahead, through from the inside, Marathon Lady third. It's a length and a half back. Awesome Mama runs fourth. Pure Fun is gaining from fifth. Gap of three, then corporate culture on the inside. Broken Val moves up. They're moving into the turn. Down along the inside, that's Marathon Lady Silcita second. Gaining from the inside, here comes Pure Fun. Then Awesome Mama, Broken Spell is also gaining from the extreme outside. As they move into the stretch, Silcita puts a head in front, Marathon Lady. Pure Fun up on the outside is third. Then it's Broken Val. Silcita has a head in front. On the inside, Marathon Lady coming back again. These two to the wire. That's a bobbing photo. Marathon Lady and Silcita. Pure Fun third. Broken Val, or Broken Spell, rather, fourth. Silcita and Marathon Lady bobbing noses right to the wire. A very tight photo here. We'll get to Pure Fun in a moment, but let's try and figure out just who wins. At first glance, it may have been the 11, Silcita, getting the nose in front, but it really just comes down to whose head was bobbing at the right time. What about Marathon Lady? Gosh, she fought back really hard at the rail. It looked like Salsita had the race, and then here came Marathon Lady back again. Yeah, she's back in front right there, and now they're just going back and forth. 211, 211, and at the wire. We're going to try and slow this down for you. It might be the 11, Mike. That is about as tight as a photo as you get. But from that angle, and I'm not sure that's 100% perpendicular to the wire, at that angle, it looked like the outside runner still see it for Todd Pletcher From and John that Velasquez. angle at that jump at the jump past the wire of the two was, was back there, in front exactly. so we'll just have to see yeah we're gonna have to wait by the way pure fun finishing third here and you, you saw Garrett Gomez get her in position on the back stretch where she wasn't as far back as she usually comes from mm -hmm. but when the real running started as they turned for home he was asking her and she just wasn't coming back to them yeah absolutely he rode there like he'd been watching the races but she ran like she'd had three months off and needed the race so it, she might have just come up a little short 11 2 5 10 on the tote board. It is now uh, unofficially posted. So it was it was Todd Pletcher and John Velasquez for the Eclipse Thoroughbred Partners. Silcita with the score.